All right, bunnies. <laughs> Why did you make all the characters in in the in the book bunnies? Okay, that is a very good question. Um, I made the characters rabbit because rabbits have very big ears, right? Very, very big ears, and rabbits can also hear really well. And the book is about hearing; it's about your ears. And so I wanted to show um, what it felt like to be the only bunny rabbit in a whole school of bunny rabbits whose giant ears did not work. They were just there for show. And I also liked how I could draw those little cords for my hearing aids going not into my ears here, but all the way over my head because that's what it felt like. It felt like I was, everybody was looking at me that the cords were all the way here. So that's why the rabbit ears. Okay. Phonic ear? Do you still use the phonic ear now? I do not use the phonic ear anymore. For one thing, it doesn't work anymore. And it was only something that I used in school. And at home, I used a completely different hearing aid. And so these days, I have one hearing aid in this ear and one in that ear. And they're called behind the ear hearing aids. So that's what I use now. Sign language. Um, did you, um, do you use it now? Do you use sign language right now? Do I use sign language right now? I don't. I would really, really like to learn it, and I probably should learn it. So, um, but no, right now I really don't know. I know a few signs, and um, and they're really fun to know those signs. So I hope to learn more. Mm -hmm. Bathroom. Mm -hmm. Why did you um, draw a deaf or hearing teacher in the bathroom? Isn't that a little inappropriate? Was it inappropriate? Yes, it was inappropriate. Um, but um, that was actually the kind of things that I was hearing. And I wanted people reading the book to sort of have the same... Um, experience that I had um, having that experience sort of like um, while the while the person is reading the book and they see the teacher in the bathroom that person is probably thinking oh my gosh well that was exactly what I thought the first time I heard my teacher in the bathroom oh my gosh and so I really wanted it in there because sometimes I actually did hear inappropriate things so I wanted the book to be true and honest. So that's why I kept it in there. What would you recommend to another kid? Slowly. Do people, do people still sometimes talk to you slowly? Yes, sometimes they do. And that can be really frustrating. Um, often what happens is I'll be having a conversation with somebody and they don't know that I'm deaf. And so they talk to me like they would talk to anybody else. But then they, they look and they see that I have hearing aids in and their whole face changes and they start talking really slowly like this and it drives me crazy because they were talking to me normally before. So yeah, it happens sometimes, but not very often. Less than that. <laughs> drawing or writing? What? Drawing or writing? Do you like drawing or writing more? That is a great question. Um, when I first started writing books, I liked the drawing better than the writing because I was more comfortable with drawing. But now, I think I might like the writing a little bit better just because I get frustrated because I can't always draw the things I want to draw or I can't draw them well enough. So I would say 51% writing, 49% illustrating i like i like writing just a little bit more but not much more <laughs> six what did you want to be when you were six say that again what did you want to be when you were six? Oh, what did i want to be when i was six that's a good question um i don't know what i wanted to be i think i was very interested in motorcycles so i think i wanted to be a motorcycle stunt rider 
something like that. <laughs> and um, as I got older though, I was very, very interested in being something called an anthropologist, which is somebody who studies other people, other um, people who are not like myself. You know, you go to another country and you study that, um, that group of people's cultures and what they eat and what they do. That's what I thought I was going to be. But that's not what I am. <laughs> what, do you, what do you say, honey? Thank you. Hmm? Oh, they, oh, you are welcome. You are welcome. I didn't know it was over. Thank you. Thank you for your great questions. Thank you.